Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is a big day for the mylinuxwork.files because the .files are now available in the Arch user repository as AUR. So you can easily install the .files now with your preferred AUR helper. With Paru, for example, or with Yay, or of course with your software center of your current Arch-based distribution. In this video, I will show you how you can easily install now the mylinux4work.files as AUR on Garuda Linux, Manjaro Linux, and on a minimal profile of Arch Linux. The version 2.9.6 of the mylinux4work.files includes several bug fixes and new features. One of the main new features is the CSH support. That was one of the key requests from the My Linux for Work users. And now it's finally there and you can easily switch between Bash and CSH. I have updated the wiki to follow the new installation procedure and please open an issue on GitHub in case of any problems or issues. And of course, if you have ideas for new features, please share it as well. And with that, let's jump in. I'm here on Garuda Linux and I want to install the mylinuxwork.files in the version 2.9.6 with the AUR package. You open the main menu and search for software. And here is Octopi. And this is a very good program to install the mylinuxwork.files on Garuda because it supports AUR packages with a Paro tool. So I click here on that icon and search for my Linux for work. And you see here two packages. The first one is the stable release, so the latest release 2.9.6. And the second one with the extension hyphen git is the latest rolling release with the latest commits. I will install now the latest stable release. With a right click, I add this application to the install list. And I can confirm now the installation by pressing that check mark. Apply. Then I pr proceed with the review because I'm using Paro. I confirm now the installation by going out of the review with Q and I accept the changes with Y. Then I need to enter the password. And now all packages that are required for the mylinuxforwork.files will be downloaded and installed on the system. And that's it. The installation of the packages is done. Now we can open a terminal because every time you update or install the mylinuxwork.files, you need to execute the setup with my Linux for work hyperland setup. I will start now the configuration. The system is checking for an AUR helper. In that case, it's Paru. And here you can decide which optional packages you want to install. Firefox, the browser, Nautilus, it's the file manager, Flatback to install flat packs, Gnome Text Editor, Gnome Calculator, Smile for emojis, and the Mission Center for the system information. I will install everything except Mission Center and Flatpak. You see, you can just press space to deselect a package, and then you confirm the selection with return. And yes. And also here we are in Paru and we need to confirm that we have reviewed the um, configuration. And with Q, I accept the changes. Let's check if all core applications are available. Yeah, every package has an OK and we can proceed. And now it's time to activate the configuration of the dot files on your system. I want to use the folder dot files, but you can also change it to files are detected to create a backup. It's a dot bash RC, the dot CSHRC. I want to create a backup. Yes. The system has detected that I run the installation in a KVM. So I will install the KVM environment variables. Then display manager. I will install SDDM and the theme. 
Yes, I want to install the SDDM sugar candy theme. Confirm with yes. Keyboard layout needs to be changed because I have a German keyboard layout and no keyboard variant. I proceed with that selection. I'm not on a laptop. I will use the my Linux for work bash RC. That's why I replace the existing one. And I now can copy the dot files. I will use the wallpapers that are chipped with the version 2.9.6. That's why I select here. No, I don't want to download the whole repository. Pywall initiated successfully and done. And we are ready to reboot. I start Garuda Linux. And now we should see SDDM with the new theme. I select here hyperlink and enter my password. And I'm already in hyperlink with the my Linux for work dot files. Here is a short post installation script but with a very important decision because the mylinuxwork.files 2.9.6 are now chipped with CSH support. So I select here CSH, I change the shell and you see that the required plugins will be downloaded. And now the last reboot. I log in. And here are the my Linux for work dot files in the version 2.9.6 installed in the folder dot files. And let's close the window with super key return. I open a terminal and you see that CSH is activated. And next time, if an update is available of the my Linux for work dot files, it will be offered through your packet manager and you can install it automatically. And then if this is done, just execute again my Linux for work hyperland setup. I'm now here on Manjaro Linux. And also here, it's very easy now to install the my Linux work dot files as new AUR package. You open here the software at remove software. In that menu, you select preferences, enter the password. And of course, it's an AUR package, so you need to activate the AUR support. And it makes also sense to check for updates in case that there's an update of the Malinux for work.files. Now you can close it and search for my Linux for work. So let, let's install the my Linux work hyperlink git and that version and download and apply. I confirm all the additional packages with apply. Yeah, and the installation has started. I need to trust that key. And you see the download has started of all required packages. I need to enter the password. And the installation is done. So let's close here that window and open a terminal because also here we need to finalize the setup with my Linux for work hyperland setup. I select yay as my preferred AUR helper. And you see, yay was not installed before, but the script will install yay now for you. And the same can, of course, also be done with Paru. Okay, I will install Nautilus, GNOME Text Editor, GNOME Calculator, and Smile as my optional packages. Installation of the optional packages is already done. Let's do a short system check. All key commands are available for the dot files and I can proceed and I will install the dot files now into the dot files folder. Two backups.
are available for .bashrc and .cshrc. I will create a backup. It's in the KVM keyboard. I change it to DE, no variant required. I proceed with the setup. I'm not on a laptop. And I will replace the existing .bashrc and I will place the existing CSHRC with the version of the Linux for work dot files. And now I will copy the dot files, the configuration to the target folder dot files. I will use the chipped wallpaper and it's done. I reboot the system now. I'm here on the login screen and I can select Hyperland. Let's log in. And here are the my Linux work dot files. The post install script will be offered. I need to enter the password. XDG desktop portal is required to, um, to run GTK applications in the dark mode. So I will install it now. And I select again CSH as my default shell. Oh my CSH, oh my posh, the required plugins will be installed and I will reboot the system again. Let's log in into Hyperland. And here we are. Hyperland in the version 2.9.6 installed in the dot files folder. And everything seems to work correctly on Manjaro Linux. I'm here on Arch Linux in a minimal profile. And also here it's possible, of course, to install the mylinuxorg.files with the new AUR installer. First of all, we need to install a AUR helper. We do this with git clone https aur.archlinux.org slash paru dot git. Now we can cd into the folder paru and can execute make pkg for make package dash si. The compilation of paru takes few seconds. So the installation of paru is done. And now I can start the installation of the my Linux for work dot files with paru dash s my Linux for work hyperlet. I accept the changes. I import the key for W logout. And the installation has started. And that's it. The installation is done. Let's clear the terminal. Now we can start the setup of the mylinuxwork.files with my Linux for work hyperland setup. And I will install the required packages with yes. I will use paru. I will deselect some packages. Confirm with return. Now the optional packages will be installed. Let's check with the diagnosis script if every, if all commands are available. Yes, every command has an okay. I can proceed with yes. And now I will copy in a second the dot files into the target folder dot files. Two files can be added to a backup, .bashrc.cshrc. I'm in a KVM. I will install the guest agent. I will install an STDM and the theme as my display manager. Keyboard, I will change it to DE. And I'm not on a laptop. I will use now the bash RC from the my Linux work dot files. And I copy now the dot files to the target folder. I will use the 
chipped wallpapers and I'm done. So I can reboot the system now. And here is SDDM with the right theme. Hyperland is already selected. It's the only desktop environment that is installed. And now I'm here in the post installation script. I enter my password. I will install now the XDG desktop portal. I select CSH as my preferred shell. And a final reboot. Let's log in into the mylinuxwork.files and here we are. The mylinuxwork.files 2.9.6 installed in the folder .files. And here's the .files app. The Hyperland app. And Rofi is there. Everything is working fine. Yeah, and that's it. This is the new version 2.9.6 of the MyLinuxForWork.Files and now in the Arch user repository SAUR. I hope you like it. And with that, see you next time.